Welcome back guys to Crypto for Life channel. Today we'd like to talk about ICP token. Let's jump in. All my ideas about Bitcoin, this current pump, I already explained it in my previous video. And also I showed my global plan for Bitcoin 2023 in previous videos. So you can find it on channel or on pin it comment in my Telegram channel. So I highly recommend you to watch full video about my plan for 2023. So you're not impressed about this uh, pump. So let's jump into the charts. Maybe uh, next week I will make a more detailed video with all explanation about uh, current situation on Bitcoin, but uh, it's not a surprise for me because a lot of people scream about 12 or 10K, but um, maybe we'll not see this price. So uh, the current situation now on Bitcoin, we got this uh, local FIB. Here is a 25 top. Here's a drop, support, breaking out, retest uh, 0 0.5 level by FIB and capitulation on FTX crash, it's a weekly time frame, to 27 zone. We're breaking out 27 zone and test 0 0.5 level by FIB once again. So now we have to take a look uh, how we close this weekly candle, how we open next one and how, the, how we follow the S&P 500. The target for Bitcoin is test of this uh, trend line, upper trend line. And now it's COVID dump. Uh, trend line is here. Uh, it's around 35K. So in next few weeks, we can test it. And I think we will test and reject. So I, I will explain later my ideas closer about Bitcoin. So what's going on now on the ICP token? So uh, almost all analysis, what you saw in my previous videos, now in play out. So don't fall in FOMO. So everything... Uh, Okay, so everything good. If you open position, you can take a profit, some part, close some part of your position or withdraw your investment. If you buying, for example, ICP at $3.46 here in this range, you can close some part of this position, you know. So it's okay. Every single time, take profit. Don't fall in FOMO and don't wait when we go to new all-time high. It's trading and every single day we can see something like this one. We can go find a rejection. Uh, uh, they will bring some fodder on the market. Uh, oh, Binance will collapse once again. Oh, China will ban uh, crypto one more time. So everything can happen. That's why uh, all this moves, it's, it's not impressed me at all. So we just follow the trend. Also, small note, if you accumulate some altcoins according to your strategy, investment strategy, not a trading strategy, not a swing trade or intraday strategy, investment strategy, just accumulate and forget about these coins for next two or three years. It's just a small note. Now the current situation on the ICP is next. We got the range, we got a top here, uh, $5.51, $8.81. We drop trade in range, first deviation, second deviation, got a FIB and I mark it, we have to break in out this level, this stop losses, next stop losses over than the, this zone, around psychological price $6. So what we can see next, logically uh, and according to indicator, you can see we got a signal to buy here, one signal and FTX crash, nobody can predict it. Uh, we got signal to close some part of position, but nobody can predict it. So some of this biggest uh, exchange is, is collapsed. So uh, here, once again, signal to buy on a daily time frame, trade and range, signal to close some part of your position. And here we got a, a signal to close our long on a daily time frame. On a weekly time frame, we don't see the signal. That's why we just follow the trend. We close this position because we're breaking out this level. Here, it looks like double bottom. According to this pattern, what we can expect? Just this size. Exact target to breaking out this uh, stop losses and took liquidity. So most likely in the next uh, weeks, uh, I can see the picture of something like this one. At least, at least we can just follow the trend, trade in some range, you know, breaking out, grab all these stop losses and come back to test this zone. Uh, $4.43. If not, it's okay, we can follow the trend, you know. So the next stops where we got a stop losses is here. Here's a horizontal line here. Next uh, step is $10. And why do I think so we can test 
ten dollar because here we get a fair value gap here pretty simple we just walk from uh, liquidity to liquidity and would be good to see the confirmation of the reversal move if we make a move like this one retest and breaking out this zone with retest and going higher to the next targets so what about indicators on a weekly time frame we got a signal to buy here confirmation after breakout so we're going out of this range it's not necessary so we have to come back and test at this zone because we already traded with a few deviations so it's okay the next step is this imbalance and in next video like i promise i will show you uh, my global idea for icp because a lot of uh, thought around this coin and here we got a weak huge week at least we have to close 50 percent of this week so if you open position like uh at four dollar for example and if we reach eight dollar you just made x2 withdraw your money your investment and just leave frequency so you will not lose anything if uh, if we make something like this one for example and crash down you will not lose uh your money you know so according to indicators what we got here it's trade on here is take profit on a daily time frame we are not so far from uh, take profit line take profit line now around five dollar 64 and exit line at six dollar 35 so usually uh, we uh, close 50 percent of this range so it's uh, and we will liquidate all the stop losses all people who open short on ftx crash in november will be liquidated like similar like this one so it will be the a local just a local uh, local trade you know uh on uh, money power we are at the top but come on we was at the bottom here uh from june till uh, october so it it mean nothing it's similar like uh, people show me oh look we are overbought on uh, rsi so what here it's the same situation uh, acc accumulation distribution we got a top so basically uh i will explain you how it works uh on a daily time frame usually it works like this one on this indicator we're forming the top and start forming the tri triangle so now we can go in higher retest this zone and on adz we make a move like this one so they will redistribute step by step and bring the FOMO on the market so on a daily time frame it can look like this one so we go in higher but on adz we go in a lower retest higher retest forming divergency you know on adz and on a weekly time frame adz start climbing into a uh, seller zone so we accumulate a lot I showed you we got a huge divergency huge divergency on a weekly time frame how people don't pay attention for it i don't know here here's the strongest accumulation ever here uh, at six dollars 75 and it's a weekly time frame we going down from may till november and till here till december we're going a half year accumulation the big players accumulate and like you can see here huge divergency how people don't see it i don't know maybe because you don't use my indicators maybe that's a problem so now we just start came into uh, the seller zone on a weekly time frame when we hit the top on a weekly time frame i think uh, in this case uh, the price for icp will be higher than uh, 40 dollar when we hit the top here and then forming the divergency from a seller from distributors and hits uh, over than 100 for icp a lot of people now don't believe in this price but uh, you will see you will see a lot of people don't believe we can break that tw uh, 17 for uh bitcoin so don't uh, celebrate too too early on a bitcoin so we can go to at least 78 level by feet then correct to 20 so we can trade in this range but most likely for bitcoin i think we will stuck we always move 
impulse, sideways impulse. So usually when we're breaking out the zero level, 25, I think we will trade sometimes in 27 till 22. In this range, we trade sometimes and breaking out uh, higher uh, around the spring. So watch again my global video about Bitcoin. Guys, I hope you like this video about Bitcoin and ICP token. Share this video with your friends, subscribe to the channel, hit the like button, hit the notification button, and don't forget to join my Telegram channel. See you next time, guys.